No, isn't it that? I'm ready to rule the world. Uh, oh. In France. de la mañana y sigo en pijama así que les voy a enseñar mi outfit okay, discúlpenme que sigo un poco dormida pero para empezar me voy a poner esta blusa que está hermosa y tiene un mickey y tiene rayitas de colores de hecho tengo unos outfits cool para este fin de semana también tengo estos shorts que literalmente los pongo 24 7 y pues calcetas y también traigo una chaqueta por si sí, se pone fresco la cosa hola hola amigos cómo están yo soy y bueno, hoy va a ser un vlog súper, súper interesante y estoy muy emocionada para que lo vean porque va a estar muy, muy cool y déjenme les explico cómo va a estar la cosa y por qué me levanté tan temprano, porque me levanté a las 6 de la mañana. Hace un año, de hecho, oh my god, hace un año, hice 24 horas hablando inglés y a ustedes les gustó mucho porque les gusta ver mucho los videos en los que hablo inglés. Entonces... Estaba pensando, debería de hacer otro 24 horas hablando inglés. Pero no quería que vieran la misma cosa otra vez, pero un poco más interesante, porque hoy vamos a hacer algo muy cool. Entonces, mi hermano Arturo se le ocurrió la gran idea de hacer 24 horas hablando inglés con acento británico. A ver, amigos, yo tengo una amiga británica que se llama Katie, no sé si la conocen. Pero bueno, ella de hecho es británica y nada más habla con el acento británico en su casa, pero bueno, con ella siempre hablo así como que con acento británico, así como que de broma, pero que Katie y cosas así. Entonces, hoy voy a hacer 24 horas hablando inglés con acento británico y lo voy a intentar porque obviamente yo tengo acento de inglés americano, like normal accent. No está difícil de que hablar inglés por un acento británico, no lo sé, este, me encanta el acento británico, la verdad. Haz de cuenta que en español sería el acento español de España, para acá en Estados Unidos sería británico. Pero bueno, eso es lo que pasa el día de hoy. Ahorita son las 8 y media de la mañana y probablemente se siente que, Heidi, ¿por qué estás despierta tan temprano? Siempre me levanto a esta hora, pero nunca estaría así de que lista y lista para irme con toda la energía. Pero es que el día de hoy vamos a ir a San Antonio, Texas. Sí, amigos, vamos a ir a San Antonio, Texas. Y antes de empezar el video, que comenten, Heidi, ¿por qué no estás en cuarentena? Amigos, mi cuarentena ya se acabó. Acá en Estados Unidos, o al menos donde yo vivo, no estamos en cuarentena y ya abrieron literalmente todo, bueno, casi todo, de que restaurantes, tiendas, malls, ya abrieron todo, literalmente. Entonces, mi familia y yo hemos estado tres meses encerrados en la casa sin salir para absolutamente nada y yo no he salido ni a la esquina, o sea, literal, bueno, sí, de que he ido tipo al parque o así, pero o sea, nada más con mi mamá y al aire libre, pero no he salido al mundo, ¿saben? O sea, no he ido a la casa de nadie, no, porque no debería, no he ido a ninguna tienda, ni siquiera a Walmart o lo que sea, porque mis papás fueron los que estaban comprando el mandado, yo no iba, y bueno, hace, yo creo, casi... Como el 8 de mayo se acabó la cuarentena, empezaron a abrir todo y no ni siquiera he salido después de eso. Entonces el día de hoy vamos a salir y vamos a ir a San Antonio que está a 3 horas de aquí de Houston. Y vamos, no sé, pues la vamos a pasar bien, como escaparnos tantito. Y bueno, amigos, si ustedes están en cuarentena todavía, por favor no salgan, no salgan, hagan como yo. Yo no salí para absolutamente nada. Y claro, claro, definitivamente vamos a tomar las precauciones, literalmente extra extra, hasta vamos a exagerar pues porque es necesario ya tengo mi tapabocas listo desinfectante de que botellitas chiquitas botellas grandes, pues para tomar las precauciones que necesitamos tomar entonces ahorita nos vamos a ir y dónde está mi celular para poner literalmente 24 horas porque amigos, voy a poner en mi tele, esta vez, la vez pasada no hice de que 24 horas, o sea hice un día, pero esta vez voy a poner en mi teléfono el timer de 24 horas, así que voy a ir por mi celular para ya empezar. Ah, y les, también les voy a enseñar, vamos a empezar el video, así de 24 horas, enseñándoles que voy a poner en mi mochila, en mi mochila, o sea, la que voy a llevar. Realmente llevo bien poquita ropa, pues porque van a ser dos noches. Ok, ya regresé y ahora voy a poner 24 horas en mi celular. No manches, nada más se pone 23 horas. Bueno, cuando suene el de 23 horas, nada más voy a poner una hora más. Ok, antes de empezar les quiero decir que si no me sale algo en acento británico, nada más lo voy a decir así en inglés como pueda. Y acuérdense que voy a intentar 3, 2, 1. 
24 hours. I mean, okay. Bloody hell. <laughs> so, this is why, why is there a car outside my window? So, what is in my backpack? Let's see, shall we? So, first of all, in this back little zipper thingy, I put this cream, which is my favorite cream, because it didn't fit in my makeup bag. Here, I'm gonna put my iPad, which is right here, which I literally just downloaded. A bunch of episodes of Riverdale so I can watch it on the way with my AirPods. So I'm gonna put this right here. And also my camera is gonna go right here too with my microphone and my tripod and my battery and all that stuff. I literally just drank really, really good coffee. It was literally like maybe the best coffee I've ever had. Anyways, my makeup bag is in my suitcase, my yellow suitcase. So here I'm gonna keep my perfume. I brought two perfumes and they're both vanilla scent because I love vanilla scent. So I brought two perfumes and this is one. I feel so classy when I do it like a British accent. My AirPods are gonna go in this little one. There's two zippers right here. I'm gonna put it in this little one. My car mix, which is the most important thing that there is. Also, in this little one, I also have two scrunchies because I'm not a visco girl, but I like scrunchies for my hair and also I brought two just in case. Also, I have this other perfume Vanilla scent, obviously. And my lipstick is also going there. And we're ready to go. Also, I have my jean jacket ready to go. Oh yeah. Let's go. And also my fish, Pedro. That's my baby. That's my fish. I already fed him. And since I got a beta fish because I can go on a trip without having to feed him every day because I can feed him every three days. That's the like maximum amount that I can like feed him. And he can go like a day or two or three without eating because when I come back, I will feed him three times again. Let's do it again. Vocals. Why does, my hair is not black. Go to my Instagram to see what my hair is actually like because it's not black, I can tell you that. I got my sunglasses too. Oh, and now I'm gonna put this in my backpack and I will see you guys later. Mwah. Ready? To rule. It's ready. Ready. No, it's not. I'm ready to rule the world. Here's my mate with me. This is my travel buddy. He will not be speaking today. <laughs> <laughs> he is. Oh, I got my mask on and we are ready to go. Look, it's pink. We're it's taking precautions in order to not get infected. Exactly. We're not letting people from like places that are like infected get in here in texas which is like connecticut new york louisiana places that are like really infected they're not letting people so don't worry about a thing anyways we are on the way and we have 22 hours 13 minutes and 14 seconds to go <laughs> So ready to go out. We're just going for a walk. We're going for a walk? Yes, we're going for a walk. What do you mean, mate? I don't know what I feel like. I forgot how to walk outside of my house and outside of anywhere else. So we are looking for a restroom that we can go to. We're literally peeing ourselves. I'm kidding. We're just walking. What makes me so, so sad is that I see people with... Sorry, I don't want to offend anyone. I look like a tourist. I look like a tourist with my camera and everything, but um, I mean, I am, kind of, technically. Okay, so we got to the hotel, and now I'm gonna give you guys a tour because I think it's pretty cool. Some specific things about it are pretty cool. So I'm gonna show you guys, and I am trying my best to do the British accent, but it is very hard. Okay, so this is the door where you enter. This is the door. But then we have a fridge right here. Oh my god, I look kind of long. Ooh. And then we have like a little kitchen over here. Uh, kitchen right here. We have, oh my god, there it is. We have a microwave. We have a bunch of cabinets. By the way, we literally disinfected everything with this before we even like stepped in over there. We got a coffee maker, which is very, very convenient because I love coffee with everything in me. And then we got the dishwasher. And I think this is a switch. Oh no, shoot. Oh, that's, <laughs> that's a thing. 
and then we have the thing over here. And then over here we brought some food of our own. We brought popcorn, tuna, almonds, all that good stuff. The sliding door. This is where you enter the bathroom. Here's the kitchen and then in front of it is a bathroom. <laughs> we have a toilet. We have a toilet and here we have the mirror. And then we have the sink. This is conditioner and body wash. And then all that good hotel goodies, a bunch of towels. And here is the shower. So this is that. And then after that, we come in here and we have the room. And over here, we have a huge TV here. We have a desk here. We have a curtain because we brought suitcases and also like bags. And then over here, we have, we have my brother right here. And then here's the room. Ooh. Two beds. So whenever like the room, there's this curtain that separates the little living room that we have. So that's like next to it. And then we have the living room all to ourselves. And here's the like, air conditioner thingy. I brought my tripod. <laughs> Anyways, and then yeah, it's just like a little like, living room. And then we have a huge, but a huge mirror. And this is basically the hotel room. How do I, like, it's so hard. Oh my god, guys. It's so hard, like, doing the British accent because I'm not British. Or Anyway, so right now, I'm going to tell you what I'm going to do. I got a meeting at 5 o'clock, so, like, less than an hour. Okay, so we just ate some food. We ordered Chick-fil-A, and I haven't eaten like that in a while, like, in a good, good while. Because since we, we were in quarantine, we tried not to order in as much you know what i mean anyways i remembered my obsession with chick-fil-a like when we were in school i would go like almost every friday with my friend katie actually i don't think there's any chick-fil-a's in england actually i don't think there's any chick-fil-a's outside of texas i don't know what it is to my eyelashes this morning that they look bomb tomorrow is gonna be a new day and then we're gonna since we are in a hotel we're gonna go eat breakfast so we are going outside we are going to the what's it called river walk river walk and we're gonna walk <laughs> <laughs> anyways it is currently 7 35 and we've got more than 12 hours to go we are going outside <laughs> What are you doing? What? Say something to your fans. In France? To your fans. Okay. It is 8.41 and my battery is running out. So I'm going to go to bed anyway because we are really tired. We just walked around for a while outside. And now I'm going to go to bed and then tomorrow I will update you guys. Like I said, I will like make it an extension. Like well, it is the next day and I did not vlog this morning. Ah, this I did morning. not vlog this morning because I don't know why. Oh yeah, because the plan completely changed. We were supposed to stay in San Antonio, but now we are in Austin. I know, right? Crazy. So we came to Austin. We were going to go straight to Houston, but now we came to Austin to go to the future school of my brother. And now he's going to college. And because my little brother... Little? I'm older than Little brother. Older. My little okay. brother <laughs> is going to college. So this is a campus where my brother... Well, not the campus. Well, yeah, it's a campus where my brother is going to go in a few years. Pretty, pretty soon. I think that, that's a... Oh. That looks so fancy right there. Oh yeah. How do you feel? Feel okay. Okay, there's a Chick-fil-A four minutes away from here. So, so this school's good to go. Exactly. Actually. If it wasn't, this you... This school deserves me. Yeah, exactly. Okay. You can't come Actually. here if there's no... Isn't what this so cool? Like, bro. And there's police help if anybody is... Okay, so this is pretty cool. Here is where the newspapers come in. And it says the Daily Texan. Yeah. You're gonna be a Daily Texan. Okay, so I think this wait, is like wait. a dorm room and this is another dorm room well, over there and they, they connect over here And then like all of those are also dorm rooms. So this is like a whole thing of dorm rooms. So there's a person meditating over there. That's pretty cool And there's people just chilling over there. I feel, I feel like that's pretty cool. I like the vibes here Wait, that is so cool. Okay, look at that. We have found our parents and So this is the school that my brother wants to go to and it's pretty cool Ooh, I'm not gonna lie. He wants to study like filmmaking yes. and all that stuff. And then there is a bridge 
that connects the other building that is over there. And this is the bridge that I was talking about. And the building is called the Moody College of Communications. Y después de eso, adivinen qué hicimos. Regresamos a casa y listo. Bueno amigos, ese es el fin del vlog. Espero que les haya gustado muchísimo. Comenten aquí abajito si les gustaría que hagan más videos en inglés porque la verdad es que me gusta mucho. Tampoco se olviden de seguirme en mis redes sociales que les voy a dejar aquí todos los links de... Y bueno amigos, os amo muchísimo y nos vemos a la próxima.